everybody, this is Mary for Stamping Camp with Mary and Mary's Stamping Happenings and today is There's a Card Thursday. And today I want to show you um, this card using a bunch of scraps. Um, I had a class, um, a class to you that used um, the um, stamp set um, Curvy Christmas and um, one of the things I cut out a bunch of um, the classic Christmas um, um, designer series paper. So I had a bunch of these left and so I wanted to do something with them and then I had a bunch of these left. These, Well actually they were uh, two, two by six um, and I cut them down to, to one and a half by uh, four. So I just wanted to do something with them without a big thing, you know. I wanted to get rid of them. I didn't want to throw them away. So I made like a hilly thing there. I don't know if you can see that. Um, what we're going to need is I am going to use Curvy Christmas and Quite Curvy. Um, for ink, I am just going to use Shaded Spruce because that goes with it. I'm using an eight and a half by five and a half piece of Sarah Sand. Just make that a card base right like that. I am using various pieces of the uh, classic Christmas. I am using a sheet. Um, this is four by five and a quarter. Um, this is one and a half by four. And these are, I cut these out for, to fit note cards. So, um, I'm going to cut them a little more so they will fit. I got to cut them at four inches. So um, we're going to be doing that. Um, then I am using blue dots. Good thing. Um, and I may, if I can find, well, I think I'll just be using glue dots. I won't put dimensionals on them. Uh, first thing I want to do is I want to cut down maybe three or four of these um, to four inches. I'll show you how you do it so it um, comes out right instead of crooked like you put it up here and you notice this isn't that straight. What you want to do is you're going to go to the four inches and you want to put one of the edges straight down on the four inch thing and then you just cut the other edge. Now, if you want to cut it on the other side, you know, you just flip it over. But I just want to do three or four of these at four inches. So they go on the um, designer series paper. And I want to get something that's not quite the same. I have three different kinds of designer series paper that I used. So there's some. Okay. So I'm also using a piece of one and a half by four inches. Now, first off, what I want to do is I want to just lay, get my short one. I want to just lay these on here um, first off. See, they fit perfectly. Um, so they look like different um, hills. And I want to make sure that it's all under there. So I want to do another, maybe do another one. Just like that. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is, I know this one will fit right up here. So I'm going to adhere this one there. 
and then this one. And you can use any adhesive if you want. I, you know, I like glue dots. And then I'm going to adhere this one. And I tell you, this, if you got a bunch of these and um, I should show you what I've made, that w how those came about. Give me a second. This is what I made. So this is really the centerpiece, except this wasn't a three and a half. It was three inches first off. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to ink up the pine trees from the Curvy Christmas with shaded spruce. And I'm going to stamp that on the top just like this, so there's another. And then I'm going to, from the quite curvy, I'm gonna just stamp the hello someplace, just like that. And then I am going to attach it to just like that. And there you go. I've used up a bunch of scraps. You could make this a, um, a Christmas card. You could make it anything you want. I just wanted to do a little hello. Um, I would appreciate it if you enjoy my videos that you shop with me at marytroutner.stampinup.net. Please follow me on YouTube. Everything you need to make this card is listed below. Please shop with me. Thanks for visiting and happy stamping. Bye-bye.